In this video, I want to show you how to share a library with a collaborator. So open in front of me is EndNote and me and a colleague, we're both working on a project together. We would both like to add references to the same library and also work on the Word document and insert references into the Word document using the same library. So here's how to go about it. Click on File, Share. Now the first time you click on Share, it will ask you to log into EndNote Web. Uh, you can follow the prompts and make sure that you log in. If you forgot your password, follow the prompts. Once you're logged in, you'll be able to share this library with somebody else. So you enter the email address here and you can write a little message here. And then just inform the recipient or the person, your collaborator, that you've shared this library with um, him or her because sometimes these auto-generated emails get lost into spam or the junk folder. Um, so I've already done this step. Uh, my colleague is already listed here and you can always remove or remind anyone that's shared on your library. So let's go on. Now I can work on this. I can add references. My colleague can add references or collaborator. And once I'm ready to sync, I go to Tools and I sync. Uh, we even tested it, um, me and my collaborator, to see what happens if both of us work on this library at the same time. Um, we even made, tested it to see what happens if we click Sync at the same time. So what happens is that when the person who clicked Sync the first, the other person's Sync button gets grayed out until Sync has been completed, where after the other person can Sync and no errors occurred, it worked perfectly. So this is really a brilliant system to use if you want to work on a shared library in EndNote. I hope this helped. Enjoy.